I got that. G'day everyone, I'm Jack, and this is Pudge. And welcome to How Many Fingers, where we take a quick look at the accessibility and approachability of a video game. So, let's check it out. We are heading back to 2023 and swinging into Marvel Spider-Man 2. New York is in trouble yet again from possibly the beefiest villain we've seen in a while. We've posted the full accessibility options on YouTube, but I wanted to highlight two things here. First, the stealth missions from the previous game are gone because Miles can now turn invisible, and they gave MJ a side piece and she's been practicing. Secondly, as a person with disability, we don't get a lot of representation in video games, so the return of Hayley Cooper is delightful. There's an accessibility option to hear her lines, which are voiced by Natasha Ophelia, a black deaf actress, but we also see that Miles and Genki use sign when they're hanging out. There's even an entire side quest where you control Haley that certain parts of the internet got mad about. I definitely recommend you play this game. 